The tears that streamed down Novak Djokovic's face at Flushing Meadows represented more than just disappointment. Defeat to Daniil Medvedev in the final of the US Open had not just seen him miss out on an unprecedented 21st Grand Slam title, but robbed him of history. Having already won the Australian Open, French Open, and Wimbledon in 2021, this was destined to be the night he became just the third male player in history to complete a calendar Grand Slam. At 35, it seems increasingly unlikely that the Serbian star will ever get the same opportunity again. His chances of emulating Don Budge, 1938, and Rod Lava, 1962 and 1969, in 2022 were essentially over before they began, with him deported out of Victoria before the Australian Open following the explosive saga over his refusal to be vaccinated. To rub salt into the wounds, he could only sit back and watch as Rafael Nadal completed a remarkable return from injury to triumph at Melbourne Park. It meant that it was the Spaniard who was first in the race to slam number 21, which promptly became 22 when he beat Djokovic en route to winning another French Open title. It all means that this week's tournament at SW19 takes on even greater significance for Djokovic not least of all, because current vaccine rules could see him stopped from entering America and playing the US Open in August. It means in all likelihood, Wimbledon will be his only chance to prevent Nadal from achieving the clean sweep that he himself has long craved. And fans can be rest assured that Djokovic will be throwing the kitchen sink at things to deny his longtime rival. For all his divisive tendencies, the determination and desire of Djokovic has never been in any doubt. Fans have never warmed to him in the same manner they have Nadal, or Andy Murray, or Roger Federer a notion that has motivated him further to one day retire as the greatest of all time. The odds are in his favor, with the lack of match practice that undoubtedly hindered him in Paris no longer an issue. Wimbledon is also a tournament he's won on six occasions, whereas Nadal, 36, has only prevailed there twice. But by no means will Djokovic count the Mallorca man out. His fighting qualities have become renowned and the absence of Medvedev and Alexander Zverev will work in his favor. The two icons cannot face each other until the final and if they do so, both will have every reason to reach the depths of their inner beings to succeed.